What is up guys, today I will have a brief review of One UI 8 and 5 main features uh, that is currently supported on Galaxy S23 Ultra. Uh, as you see here, what's new, what uh, Google tried to indicate to us or Samsung actually underlined the 5 features. Let's go one by one. So the first feature actually it's called captions uh, to show what each person say on the screen in real time. So let's try it out. You can activate it and you can select uh, any language that you like actually there are many languages available as you see spanish turkish korean and more others more than 20 languages available for these features and in live you will get that translation of the calls and what the caller said to you so let's test it out now so okay i'm calling now so let's test it out here we will have the special button once the phone call picked up, uh, you can click on this button. So you click here and then uh, the person on the other side just saying something. Actually, just say my words now. Hi. What's up? What are you doing now? Okay. Okay, as you see here, you can clearly see what I'm saying here. And what another person saying to me and actually it's working quite well so let's move back to what else we have here uh, put your best face forward so actually this can help you to fix blinks odd expression or miss smiles actually in the gallery app now you can select the best face out of photos so if you have five photos for example you can select your face or face of, of another person that match you best Actually, it's quite convenient to have it and quite interesting feature. Uh, also, get recommended wallpapers from your own images. So, actually, you can put your own image as a wallpaper and customize the font based on your preferences as well. The next one, actually, try a lock screen clock that fits to your photos. So, actually, it's quite stylish lock screen with a new font available to make a lock screen stand out on the crowd. So uh, let me show you how it works. You lock your screen here, then you hold it up, wallpaper. Then I select as an example, some wallpaper here. Then you change to this second uh, style here and you can make it bigger. Let's remove this thing here as for now. And as you see, you move it and it's actually adjusted here as you move it so for example you can make it bigger and move it left maybe move like this or uh, okay it will not go up anyway so maybe you can do it this way here from this side or from another side change the color and adjusting automatically based on your uh, picture here Maybe this picture is not that perfect, for example, but it's still working, as you see here, how it can look like. So it's actually up to your preferences whether you like it or no. So let's back. So actually, as you see an example, it's uh, suitable for portraits quite well, uh, but in general, someone will find usage of it. Easier access to Galaxy Buds settings, so I don't have Galaxy Buds as for now, but I'm planning to purchase it in the nearest future. So now in the settings, you will have this option of managing the uh, bots here but now it's not available actually what that's all what advertised by google here or samsung so actually see the update list is one ui 8 based on android 16 currently i'm using galaxy s23 ultra and here we have all the list you see it's quite huge uh, of the changes you can see it in the full video this full video already available on my channel uh, some DEX features available as well that is quite nice to use. Uh, also to highlight calendar reminder, it's all just minor changes. And for Galaxy Eye, you already know, so it's actually also can have create unique uh, portraits here, some personalization, productivity, multitasking as well. As you see from design, yeah, of course, it's a bit changed, just some minor changes in a uh, uh, apps how they look like uh, also here we have uh, from the settings you see, you see also some nice uh, redesign as well but in general this changes is mainly to fix all the issues as you see one ui 7 was released in may for this phone for galaxy 
uh, S23 Ultra and now is September actually already October 2025 and it's four months passed from uh, from May 2025 until now and in four months it actually is uh, all the issues were fixed in this version and it's working really well uh, battery life increased uh, I use it for two days and I feel that battery feels much better let's say maybe 20% growth I can expect because in one UI 6 it was good one UI 7 the battery life decreased and now it's again back to normal level and I really recommend to update working well operating well and for Galaxy S23 Ultra is really ultimate update after one UI 7